What happened? Why is her illness gotten worse now? You're not doing your job well. Madam Ron, pardon me for saying, Grand Concubine Joe is getting old. It's normal for her condition to be unstable. Rather than reprimanding these ladies who serve her, shouldn't you make preparations? And in your opinion, how much time does she have? Three to five days at least, eight days at most. I see. It seems it's heaven's will. Madam Ron, the Grand Concubine's very ill. I don't think the medicine has any effect. How about the sorcery dance? She's Chi Hu after all. They have great witch doctors. If we can get a witch doctor to do the sorcery dance, her condition may improve, right? I don't believe in sorcery, but I have heard it said that witch doctors of the Chi Hu tribe do have their ways. That they can do wonders for their tribe's nobles. Madam, the Grand Concubine has always been affable. Please find a witch doctor for her. It's not my decision. I'll inform Concert Show. Wait! What are you up to? Explain yourself! Hooray! What's the meaning of this? Actually, I think the same as you do. I feel regret for poisoning her like that. I've read scriptures for her for six years. How can I stand by and watch her die? So if I can get her a witch doctor and a chance, I'll have done my duty to her. Believe what you want. Hey! What is your plan? We'd like to know. Evan tells me. If she drinks the miracle medicine, she's sure to recover. What miracle medicine? Take her. She favored most among you. With a piece of flesh near her heart, make her a soup to drink. The Grand Concubine will recover fully. This is nonsense! Who would use such methods to save people? Lu Chen, please calm yourself. The witch doctor didn't say use your flesh. Or are you scared to face death? Not willing to spare a little flesh to save her? It seems that she doted on you in vain. And after she promoted you to second rank palace maid too. But in her time of need... This is slander! You're clearly in league with them! You... Uh, uh, let me go! Let go, Lu! Sister Lu! Let us go now! Let go! Let go! Madam, uh, Lu Jen is Grand Concubine Joe's favorite personal maid. But she's afraid of death. At the critical moment, she shows disloyalty. It's a changing hall matter. Settle it amongst yourselves. Yes. <gasps> now don't worry. I just need a little flesh. Just a little piece. It won't hurt much. This is how you show your loyalty to her. No, no, don't! <laughs> Please! Enough. When will you stop this farce? La May, what have you come for? It's come to Madame Lo's attention that this place is a mess now. She asked me to come and see. Look at this. You've summoned a witch doctor and restrained a maid? Do you think this is an opera? You, release her. Uh, but Madame, we need her. Keep quiet! <laughs> This is your place. I didn't want to intervene, but this is simply outrageous. Even Madame Lo won't stand for it. That's why she sent me here. Oh, Rune Young, you've been with Concert Xiao and Madame Wang for many years, right? How can you not see what they're up to here? You're even condoning a human sacrifice? Can you bear the consequence when His Highness blames you for indulging in witchcraft, leading to a death? Well. That's not my intent. From the way you're dressed, you're a first-ranked maid? Yes. Since you're a first-ranked maid, you must be a trusted aide to your master. 
So since you have such a belief in that witch doctor, cut off a piece of flesh around your own heart and make with that a soup to heal her. Oh no! No, madam! Please spare me! Please spare my life! Silly girl. You were just trying to persuade Lu Zhen, though. It's hard to show your loyalty, right? So why plead for your life? Don't waste time. I have to get back and report to Madame Lo. Sister, just a small piece, okay? Do it yourself, and you can still live. No! No! If you can heal her by sacrificing a little bit, she'll reward you. Let you leave. There. You take a piece of her flesh. Prepare the soup for your master. Ah, 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 ah.